So for the second week, Pastor John MacArthur hasn't been speaking at Grace Community Church, which is a little unusual from what I understand because he did just have a, uh, a leave of rest for several weeks and then came back I think for just a week and the last couple weeks he hasn't been teaching. Pastor Steve Lawson preached in his place this morning and uh, they did not, from what I know, I didn't notice any specific information given about Pastor John MacArthur, but when Steve Lawson came up to speak, this is what he had to say about Pastor MacArthur. Well, what a glorious Sunday morning this is at Grace Community Church and what a great worship service this has been. And as I step into this pulpit, the Bible says to give honor to whom honor is due. And the Bible says to esteem your leaders. And I just want to say, I love John MacArthur. <laughs> you have the greatest pastor on planet Earth. And not only is he your pastor, but he has been so uniquely raised up by God in this hour of church history that he really is America's pastor. And he is the leading voice of evangelicalism. He is the last man standing. God always has the next generation, and they're out there somewhere standing in the shadows. But right now, there's one strong man who is an atlas, who is upholding the faith once and for all delivered to the saints, and that's the man who stands in this pulpit. May God bless him. May God strengthen him. May God hold him up. May God give him another hundred years. He's going to outlive all of us. So. <laughs> so Pastor Steve Lawson there obviously heaping some high words of praise on Pastor John MacArthur. And uh, like I said, I didn't hear any specifics in this uh, service on Pastor MacArthur's health. I know from what they said last week, they said he was resting. And it's possible that they will give some more information tonight at the evening service. I'm recording this before... Uh, they have conducted their evening service, so we'll see if they give any more information. But from what I'm gathering here, uh, Pastor Lawson is saying there that uh, Pastor MacArthur is going to outlive all of us. So uh, I do get the sense that there's a health issue here that we should be keeping in prayer, but it sounds like Pastor MacArthur will make a recovery from whatever health issue he's facing. Also, I just want to mention that it's easy for people to heap ridicule right now on someone like Pastor MacArthur, who might be facing a health issue, even possibly something like COVID. So it's easy for people to heap criticism on someone like Pastor MacArthur because of the stance that he's taken. But I just want to encourage people, we really should not wish evil on anybody or on their ministry, even if we disagree with them. But I know it's easy for people to say when someone gets sick, it might be easy for them to say, well, I told you so. But something we have to remember is that even if we are talking about something like COVID, people that have tried to follow all the stipulations and guidelines, it's still possible for those people to get ill and even pass away from disease. So I think we have to be really careful about playing the blame game, and especially when we don't really know all, the, all of the information we really need to be careful about speculation and gossip. And I'm certainly not encouraging gossip. I really just want to encourage prayer. And I do hope that the church will give some more clear information so that we can know how to pray and know exactly what's going on. But I know a lot of people probably would be curious and wondering about this. I know I was. But that's the best information that I've heard. Unless I miss something in the service, you can leave that in the comments below if I did miss something. But thank you so much for listening to this report and some of my thoughts brought to you from a fresh perspective.